Hi, it's Zach here again with CableWholesale.com. In today's video, we wanted to take some time to introduce our new line of Datacom parts. Now that you have mounted a nice new TV to the wall, it's time to tackle the problem of exposed cables from the back of the TV to the devices they connect to. With a little bit of time and a few tools, you'll be able to tame the cable clutter. Let's take a look at just some of the styles of pass-through we carry here at CableWholesale.com. Let's first start by mentioning that we carry plates and pass-throughs in black, brown, white, and light almond colors. We carry sizes in single, dual, and triple gang, and different styles as well, such as the cable plate with the flexible opening and the brush style pass-throughs. Check out our website for all the different styles that we offer. We carry parts that require the installation of low voltage mounting brackets. But here, we have a line of easy mount parts that have mounting wings that latch to the back of the drywall to provide a secure connection. So here we have three examples. We have the low voltage mounting bracket, if you do choose to go with these. And we also have a dual gang pass through with the mounting bracket already installed. And this cable plate here is with the flexible opening you can see on the back of the wall, this mounting bracket has these wings here that latch on to the drywall once they are screwed in to provide a secure connection. When installing a pass-through, you can install these low voltage mounting brackets or the easy mount plates which has the wings integrated into the plate itself. These save you the hassle of having to install a separate mounting bracket. The instructions come with a template so you can easily cut out the hole in the wall. Once you screw down the plates, the wings come down and hold it into place. For this installation, you'll need a drywall saw, an easy mount plate, a screwdriver, electrical tape, an optional pull rod. Now let's get started. Now in this scenario, we have already had a licensed electrician provide a power outlet to give power for the television. Now we are going to get the pass-throughs installed to run HDMI cables, Ethernet, audio cables, and so forth. Here, we are using the Easy Mount series of pass-throughs. This product line does not require a separate mounting bracket. When we open the package, there is a sheet of instructions that includes a template for the size of the hole you need. We know the studs on the wall are 16 inches apart. Now, in the wall we built for this video series, there is no insulation behind the drywall between the studs. When we cut our holes, we will be able to pull the cables through pretty easily. If there is no insulation behind the drywall, you may need to Use a pull rod or fish tape to get the cables from one hole to the other. Trace the template on your wall. Use a drywall saw to cut out the drywall. Install the upper pass through and bundle cables with electrical tape. Feed the cables through the pass through. Pull the cables through the bottom hole that was cut out and mount the pass through to the wall. And there you have it, your cables are now hidden from view. In addition to these easy mount pass throughs, we carry a recessed Pro Power Kit. This particular Pro Power Kit comes with an extension cord that you would plug into an existing power outlet to the bottom plate. You would buy a power cable from your local home improvement store to connect the top or bottom plate with that power cable. The top plate now can provide power to the TV. Again, please consult local building codes prior to installation. These Datacom easy mounts are not only easy to install, but also a clean way to set up your home theater without the cable clutter. To purchase any of these parts, check out our website. If you have any questions, our tech support is here to help, Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. Eastern to 5 p.m. Pacific, by phone and live chat. Send us your questions or any suggestions for products or videos to our email or visit us on Facebook and Twitter or simply leave a comment below. We hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos. Thanks for joining us today. We'll see you soon.